This afternoon, I'm going to take you into my classroom demo teaching. So come and enjoy. Before we're going to proceed, we'll have first our house rules and reminder. First rule is you're going to participate actively for every group activity and group presentation. And you need to be an active participant in all the tasks. So what was the topic last meeting? Anyone who can recall for the topic? In connection with the nerves? System. Or in general, that is a nervous system. Am I right, Micah? Yes. Right. So it's a nervous system. It is what? It is consists of the brain and the nerves and spinal cord. I did each one of you for this. So it's used for the pre-test and for the post-test. Do not answer the column for the post-test. Only the pre-test. Okay, one for you, Timmy. only okay so you have your instruction look at first okay so I have here each student is given one pretest card so you have your pretest card right and then you have here write your answers in the pretest column this is not recorded so it means this is formative then be honest so you can compare your answers with the result on the pretest and the post test so you are given three minutes to answer Three, two, okay. Oh. This will be group one on this side. On that side, group two, three at the center, four on this side, five here. Okay, proceed. Silently, proceed silently. Class will be divided into five groups, so you're now in your groups, right? And then you're going to choose a leader and a secretary, okay? You're going to list down all the members in your group in a one-fourth sheet of paper. And then the group shall answer the card within five minutes. So you're given five minutes to post your answers. You have your strips, right? Yes. Okay, very good. Post. Okay, your timer starts now. Answers. Okay, so this activity is entitled Identify Me. So what are you going to identify? That is the parts and functions. So based from your activity, what do you think is our topic for today? Yes, Rick, a very good shallow. It's all about the endocrine system, specifically on the parts and function. We have here the day's obje uh, objectives, the day's obje uh, objective of the day's lesson. First, identify group three. Read first, everybody. Identify the major parts of the endocrine system. How about group five for the next objective, group five? Locate the major parts of the endocrine system. And group one and two. Express the importance of endocrine system for the differentiated Okay, very good. So let's check your answer, whether your answers are correct. So you have here, for group one, that is color red, am I right? Yes. Then group two, yellow, three, blue, four, magenta, and group five is green. Let's check your answer. Okay, so you have here, okay. So you have here, red. Where's red? So that is pituitary, correct? Yes. Okay, so you have your one. Next, yellow, pituitary. Okay, 
Then how about this one is pancreas, right? So that is color yellow and red again. What are the functions of each part? Okay. And everybody read question one. How many parts of a liquid has? How many parts? Okay, next. What are they? Well, question. How many endocrine gland, gland has? Is it five or six? Six. Five. five only. Why five? Because ovaries and testes belongs to reproductive, right? Okay. Very good. Okay, next. So you have here the definition. For pituitary, it produces growth hormone and control other glands. So what do you think are the diseased under this? If, if you lock the hormones in the pituitary gland. Yes. Danny girl? Dwarfism. Dwarfism and the other one is? Giantism. Giantism or giantism. So that is. So when we say less, less production of the growth hormone, is that dwarfism or giantism? Dwarfism. Dwarfism. And if it's too much, giantism. very good. Next we have here the pancreas. Okay. It regulates blood sugar level. Okay, what so do you think will happen if your pancreas will not function? Diabetes, so that is. Okay, so next, we have your testes. Everybody read for the definition. So what are these maturation that is visible for all the males? Enlargement of the Adam's apple. Another? The beard, right? Okay. Boys. Okay, the enlargement or the loud the loudness, right? Okay, very good. Next, how about for the thyroid? Everybody read again the function. Okay, so body metabolism. So that is for thyroid. What if your thyroid gland will not function properly? What will happen? What could be the disease? Obesity. Obesity? Yes, it could be another. Your uh, malnourishment on what part? Body metabolism and storage of calcium. That. What's that O? Osteoporosis. Right. Okay. Tama ba? Okay, very good. Okay, next. How about for the adrenals? Okay, in times of emergency, the adrenaline rush. Well, there is a fire. Okay. Your house is burning. And then you jump coming from the second floor into the ground, then carrying the refrigerator. Can you imagine that? Yes, yes you can because that is adrenaline rush. So that's the function of our adrenals, right? Okay. Next, the last one for ovaries. Everybody read. Okay, so what are the visible I know. The hair, the pubic hair for male and female. Another, the, the breast enlargement and the hip enlargement and menstruation. Yeah, formation of curves. Question on the functions? None. How about the parts? None. Okay, very good. So I have here, for further information, so this is for enrichment, you're going to watch this video. Hi. Hormones in our bodies. So tell me, what can we forget? Mr. Thyroid has four tiny friends called parathyroids. These glands control the calcium level in your body. These sitting like crowns on top of your kidney are triangle-shaped adrenal glands. 
the adrenal glands produce hormones like adrenaline that gives your body an extra boost in times of stress, like during an exam. So every year, we'll proceed with the post-test. Again, you are given three minutes, so you can answer now that post-test. Cassie? Okay, so let's check. Very good. You finish ahead of time. So let's check your answer. Exchange with your seat mate. Be honest. Can you check? Pre and post. Must produce antibodies. Okay, one point. Pancreas, so the answer for pancreas, what's the answer? That regulates blood sugar. Number three. Very good. Give yes, a nice clap for everybody. Nice clap. Everybody. Okay, next. Same groupings. Okay. So what you're going to do is you're going we're going to have a DI on MI. So this is differentiated instruction using multiple intelligence intelligences. Okay. So this will be by group again. One, two, three, four, five. Proceed to your group. I'll give you five minutes to prepare. What are you going to do? Yes, yeah, we are first. Before we're going to proceed, let's be guided with the rubrics, guys. So yeah, we are you're given five for the relevance of the topic if the presentation is relevant to the topic. So that is five. Five minutes, guys. Proceed to your group. Okay, so that is group three. Ahead of time, group three. One, two, three, go. Endocrine, endocrine system. Endocrine, endocrine system. One, two, one, two, three, go. The endocrine hormones have control, mood growth and development, metabolism and reproduction. And regulates how much of each hormone. Clean, lean, endocrine. Clean, lean, endocrine. Hormones make the endocrine system work. They're always around. They're always lurk. And they so, so many things. And to the body, the blood always brings. So many chemicals all over bound. Each only binds to a specific receptor found. Sometimes they're sometimes they're low. La, la, la. Everybody knows head, shoulders, knees, and toes. But can you show where all the endocrine glands go? The secret chemical messengers known collectively as a hormones. Good, good afternoon, everyone. Everyone, and we are the group five, and we are assigned to make a short story. And our story is entitled "The O Endocrine." There you go. Oh, endocrine system. You are made up of glands that makes hormones. Hormones are the body's chemical messengers. Good afternoon, class. Take a seat. So today, we will be talking all about endocrine. Endocrine is a collection of glands 
that produces hormones. It consists six parts, which is the thyroid, the testes, the adrenal, the pancreas, the ovaries, the pituitary, and that's all. As the teacher was discussing, the students of the other hand were very much paying attention to the class. Class, pay attention! But ma'am, it doesn't seem very important. Your yeah, mom, is it really important to learn about endocrine? Yes, of course. It is very important. Endocrine are responsible for our health and development. It regulates the growth of our metabolism and development. Without endocrine, one human won't seem to exist without it. We are very sorry, mom. We didn't know that endocrine is very important. Yes, class. You all should know because endocrine is vital for human health. And with that, the whole class learned the whole importance of endocrine and the never underestimated importance of it. For without it, human progression will never come to possibility. Okay, guys. <laughs> okay. Um, give a sabungan clap for the last presenter. You know what sabungan? One, two, three, one, two, three. That one? Okay. Everybody, five to seven, go. Okay, so you will be rated. So you have your five for the relevance. Uh, that is promptness. Relevance. Okay, so you have your relevance. And then for cooperation, all of the group members cooperated. Very good. And for the presentation, maybe I'm going to put a perfect score for the group of Shanine. Yes. So that's group of group four, right? Yes, ma'am. And then you have also here the promptness three, then you have your nice one, and then you have your Ayel, hmm, a four and a bayou palm, five and a song four. Okay, so you have your, your final scores. If you can see, you have here, what's the final score for group one? That's 19. For group two, 20 yell. 19, four. 20, how about this one, 18. Okay, so that's your final score. Give. What do you want a club for everybody? That's what? That's a crocodile club. Let's do the crocodile club. You know what's cro crocodile club? One, two, three, one, two, three. That's it. Everybody, five, seven, go. Okay. So, we have here. Thank you so much for your participation.